In this video, I want to show you how to expand x plus y to the power of 6. So as you know, we can break it up like x plus y times x plus y all the way to x plus y. So we can do it 6 times or we can have x plus y squared times x plus y squared times x plus y squared. You can multiply all these three terms. Or you can have x plus y cubed times x plus y cube. So I choose the last one. So we had it in other videos that x plus y cube is x cubed plus 3x squared y plus 3xy squared plus y cubed. Then we multiply it by x cubed. Same thing, 3x squared y plus 3xy squared plus y cubed. So I multiply this by this, this, and this, and this. And same thing for other terms. So we'll have 16 terms at the end and we start simplifying them. So x cubed times x cubed is x to the power of 6. <coughs> x cubed times this one will be 3 x to the power of 5 <coughs> y plus 3 x to the power of 4 y squared and then I have x cubed y cubed plus 3 x squared y times x cubed plus Yes, plus 3x squared y times 3x squared y, so it will be 9x to the power of 4y squared, plus 3x squared y times 3xy squared will be 9x cubed y cubed, and then 3x squared y times y cubed, 3x squared y to the power of 4, plus 3xy squared times x cubed it will be 3x to the power of 4y squared, plus 3xy squared times 3x squared y will be 9x cubed y cubed. Then I have 3xy squared times the same thing, which is 9x squared y to the power of 4, plus 3xy <coughs> to the power of 5. And finally, we have y squared y cubed times x cubed, y cubed times 3x squared y, Then I have 3x y to the power of 5 and then y to the power of 6. So now I need to simplify it. So I write x to the power of 6. This one and this one and what else? Yeah, I can combine these two. It will be 6x to the power of 5y. Next one definitely will be x to the power of 4y squared. So we have 3 here. We have 9 here. So 12 so far. And we have 3 more. So it will be 15. Plus x cubed, y cubed. We have 1 here. 9 here, 10, and 9 here, 19, and 1 here, it will be 20, plus x squared y to the power of 4, 3 here, 9 here, it will be 12, 12 and 3, it will be 15, plus x y to the power of 5, so what we have we have 3 here, and we have 3 here, so it will be 6, and finally we have y to the power of 6. So that's how we expanded x plus y to the power of 6. So the answer will be x to the power of 6 plus 6x to the power of 5, y plus 15x to the power of 4y squared plus 20x cubed y cubed plus 15x squared y to the power of 4 plus 6x y to the power of 5 plus y to the power of 6. So that's how we expand it. If you have any question, please leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thanks.